It is officially week one. I'm Nick Underhill. He's Mike Triplett, and you're watching The Dot, presented by Matt Bowers Auto Group. Curtain's about to come up on this team. We've been previewing it, talking about it, discussing theories for the last six months. Game starts on Sunday. What is the first thing you are most eager to watch, most eager to find out about this edition of the Saints? It's a no-brainer. It's Clint Kubiak's offense. I mean, we've talked about it. We've theorized what it might be, what it might look like. We've seen glimpses of it in practice. But even he himself told us, we won't find out what it looks like until week one against Carolina. He told us that. I think during OTAs or mini camp. Well, months later, we finally get to see what it looks like. As you've made the great point, he does things to set things up, to make this look like this, and then this, and then later do this. He wants to build a 70-play plan, and that's when we will be able to evaluate it for the first time. Yeah, I'm extremely excited to see that. We've been watching the same thing here for a very long time. I think it got a little bit long in the tooth the last couple of years, and they definitely need to make the change. That's probably at the top of my list, too. Dennis Allen kind of described it today as like unwrapping the Christmas present. That's going to kind of be how it feels once we start to figure that out. But for me, just going a different direction, it, it's the blocking. And I think that's the thing that's going to define the whole entire season. They're going to need to get the ball out quickly in this game. Can they cover up for Trevor Penning? Can they do what they need to do to operate this offense? And if they can't, what does that mean for the rest of the season? What do they do in week two? Who's the personnel? So there's some things to be excited about and some things to kind of maybe Yours, grit your – Yeah, <laughs> something to maybe grit your teeth a little bit and hope for the best. But we're going to find out what it is this Sunday when the Saints kick off their season against the Carolina Panthers.